This is the Chinese Embassy, located in Kappa State, Grosley, where St. Lucian contractor, Renault, CIE, was brought in to do some construction works on site. Why is the vehicle locked inside of there? Okay, you see the vehicle mash up his, his road. So you want this road fixed, you want the boss to come and fix up his road first before the vehicle can come outside there. The excavator is going to work for them, right? So you see you don't want the excavator to track any asphalt. See, you want the truck to back up inside of there. So I back up inside of there and I load the machine. He came and he looked, you see, the truck mashed up my road. So you have to get the boss to fix that road before he can go. He said, he tell the officer to close the road, close the gate. I'm not living there. And that's it. And he's still inside there right now as we speak. He's still inside of there as we speak. Yeah. But didn't he contract you all to do the work that you're doing there? Yes. Are you all finished doing the work that you're supposed to do? We finished doing the work. We complete. So we come and take the equipment to go with it. Mm -hmm. You see, we have to go the road before we can go with the equipment. And you said that he had an officer. Yeah, the officer knock off and go on. Um, what do you mean? A private security officer? Um, he worked with special res um, reserve. I heard that you all were locked. Some of people were locked inside yeah, of there. Some of us were locked inside of there. How many of you all were, were stuck inside of there? Five of us. Is it true that you all were stuck inside of yes. the embassy there? Yes, yes, we were stuck in because after loading the loading the equipment, Chinese came. He looked at the road. He said that we've got to fix it before before we leave, and he instructed the officer at the gate to close the gate and don't let us out. We have to fix the road first. And he is still right there right now. Yes. And how many? And all of you all were locked inside for about how long? We all we were there from one o'clock. So you all have been locked inside of that facility, yes, the Chinese embassy, from one o'clock? Yes. We said that we cannot get out. Because we had a little malfunction with the truck. We repaired it, but we cannot get out. Uh, the damage that he's talking about, that he locked the truck inside for, that's these little skid marks on the, the tire marks on yeah, the ground? the tire marks on the, on, the, on, the, on the road there, yes. But is, I, from what I'm seeing, let me try to mm -hmm. zoom. What I'm seeing there, that's not any kind of, that's not something that's permanent or, or major damage to the road. No. But that looks like mud almost. Exactly. So these are what he locked the truck inside for? That's right. He said, my boss had to fix that before the truck can go outside. I noticed, it looked like the asphalt was probably hot or something. And as I drive, you know, there's a little tire mark that's living on that. Not, it's just, I'm going to just brush away for a broom. And y'all are con, y'all are con. I am here. Until one o'clock this afternoon, I'm here. And all of y'all were locked in here since yes. one o'clock? Yes. I tell him, let me go outside and that's all like my boss. He said, no, my boss had to come here first. So a senior official from the company comes up together with the police to try to resolve the matter. His official expresses his concerns about the damages while the company official takes umbrage to holding his workers inside the property against their will as well as keeping the equipment locked behind the gate. This is right. Okay. This is right. Okay, that's not the way that we do. Where is police? You cannot hold my... my yeah, police, the police. police is right. Tell him. Come up. Come police is right. Police. Okay, sir. Hello, good afternoon. Can I have a word with you, please, sir? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never been behind bars, yes, sir. I've never been behind bars. Come and say, Paul, that was madman. That was crazy, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So you want to speak for the rest of you? Oh, no. good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Couple yeah. Noble from the Special Service Unit. Okay. Can you open up your gate, gate for me, please? Why? Boss, I'm inside of your, of your property. You are treating me. Okay, mean, you why? can't go out. You can't go out. How do you mean, why? Yeah. Your car is police commission. What? Police, police, your car. You just receive it. You just receive the call. No, no, listen. This is the police. That's who? Okay, who's Hillary? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's, 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 he's a uh, uh, leader in the police station. Listen, listen, who's Hillary Emanuel? 
Emmanuel is the person in charge of the grocery space station. No, it's not. It's not. Yes, okay, okay, you can speak to him. You. Take my cell phone in my vehicle, please. Okay, you can, you can go. Hello? Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Black man, dogs. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I get a... Why are you preventing him from going out to the I'm not to prevent him. I'm just the one to talk to her. Move your dog because I have no problem. No, 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 I never prevent anyone to go in out, but I want to talk to them first. Yes. Okay, that's so, it. Okay, well, no, hello, hey, Papi, hey, I have my... Hey, no, my, no, my, no, no, I don't want to let the dog... Okay. Uh, hey, Dad, the man has to release the truck, then I talk to him about the road. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing that. You can't hold my truck. That costs how much money must it? No, release the truck. Release the truck. Listen, listen. Whatever work that has to be done, yeah. that is not what we'll be doing. Do not come up here for something different. So then why, why, okay, why are you holding the truck? And four hours, so they, four hours holding the other fellas. Hello? Yes? I'm not here. I'm not here. I just to come here. Yes, sir. Okay. Boss, get that. You cannot hold the truck, boss. You cannot release the truck and then I will discuss with him. I'm not doing that. And ask him why he hold the workers inside from one o'clock. Yeah. Yeah. They lock the fellas inside from yes, one o'clock. I was locked in yeah. for 15 minutes. For one o'clock, yeah. all the workers are stuck inside there. Look it's them right there. It's not just a matter of us. We have to do the job. right way. You cannot yes, hold another job. job. The customer was waiting. Eh? So the excavator is supposed to go we'll somewhere. Another job. Yeah. 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 So then, let me switch to the inspector. Yeah. Oh, we have to open the door for him. No problem. But you open the door for everyone. For everyone. No problem. We just talk. But he's angry, he cannot stop. I wasn't angry when I came here. I wasn't, wasn't angry. Now I'm angry. Yeah, you can you're angry. You're angry. Yeah. Now I'm angry. Now I'm angry. I wasn't angry you when I came here. You take picture for me. You are, you are, you are violating to my person. No, no you start in the first. So you, I never keep, you start, no, it's, no, no, it's, not, it's not a violation to put for, to have workers stuck no, no, inside? I'm the, the case. It's okay. not a violation to have workers locked inside a place? What if they had to get home to their families? What? What if the people that you locked there from one o'clock what if they had to get home to their families? You should have let me to tell the story from the beginning, okay? Would they, what gives you, you permission to be locked? What, you, why you can you lock them inside? That's the question. You should have let me tell the story. There is no scenario that allows you to lock people inside of a building, inside of a premises. From 1 o'clock to 5 o'clock, the fellas locked inside. They have no scenario. If I locked you or locked your family inside of a private property, you would be vexed too. Here's a jail. You come there, pick it up. Question for you, St. Lucia. It's very simple. Is this right? Is this how our people should be treated in our own land? Oh, that's all right now.